Hey everybody, and it's time for a another LP. From the land of the rising sun, a lone warrior was catapulted to a magical realm. It was a world on the brink of catastrophe, and its people called desperately for a hero. Now, only Musashi can thwart the mad designs of a ruthless corporation. One man, one chance, one destiny. Everyone, this is Musashi Samurai Legend. Now, I know it says Samurai Legend Musashi, however, the way that uh, Square Enix introduced it, it was Musashi Samurai Legend. I know it doesn't make sense, but since that's the title they gave it, I'm going to use it. Let's start a new game, and let's see where this game takes us. Loading screen is very animated. I like that, actually. Now, this is actually a favorite game. And we'll go into why after this cutscene. Once again, cutscenes are unskippable in this game. Just like Demon Stone. Hurry, Your Highness! They're here! Yes, I know! I must complete the summoning! Now, a lot of people complain that the uh, voice acting in this game is absolutely horrible, but I actually don't mind it too badly. Your Highness! Oh no! You monsters! Ow! Ow. I guess they're supposed to be ninja or something. Ah, there you are. We could have worked this out amicably, you know. We are the proud people of the Anthodon. If you think we will bow to you, you are sorely mistaken. Princess Mycella of the Mystics, you clearly misunderstand us. President Yandrake is a fine man. Indeed, modern civilization owes him a debt of gratitude. Yes, no one opens their mouths. Your civilization stands on the foundation of blood! How disappointing. I had thought you more reasonable. Take her away. So, that was Princess Mycella. Um, she is actually a very important character to the story, and she's just been kidnapped by the Gandrake Corporation. Who are they? Well, we'll find out. Whoa, what was that? Hey, ya! What have we here? Greatest cat ever. A week, huh? 
And just like that, they give us control, which is pretty good. Now, these are basic controls. Right stick moves the camera. X to jump. Left stick to move around. Uh, D-pad actually does nothing. You can hit square in order to attack. We have a three-hit combo. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, triangle does nothing. Circle does nothing. And L1 guards... And we get this nifty little uh, area. What? What's in it? We we don't have anything in this little area, so we'll find out later. Now we can access the menu through Start. Uh, select seems to do nothing. So now that we've gone over the basic controls, let's start. I'm all set, Whisker dude. Yeah, he sadly sounds like some kind of surfer samurai or something like that. It's kind of weird. He is actually the same voice actor who did Axel in Mega Man X7. So, that's a little random trivia for you. Very good, Musashi. This is Master Mew. He is awesome. He is the greatest cat ever. He also has weird One facial hair. You survived training in ways of stray cats. Stray cats, sweet. Wait, for a week? No. For final lesson. Alright. He basically goes over the basic controls. I skipped through that because, well, I already explained them. break those open, those green orbs are health. Now, you just need to wander around a little bit, and then the next part comes in. Now he teaches you how to attack. He teaches you the, that the katana is a light attack, but it's incredibly quick. So it's sort of like Legend of Mana in that aspect, in which you have a light attack, but wait, I don't have a heavy attack. Press X to talk to people. Okay, well, this is stuff I would have figured out on my own. So now he explains how R1 works. It's actually your lock-on. Now he teaches you a little bit about the force gauge, in which case, if you hold R1 while concentrating on an enemy, this force, this focus gauge will fill up. Now, why would we want to fill that up? Well, he'll actually explain that to us in a little while. Now we get our first fight. We don't really do a lot of damage yet. Let's head on over here. Now he teaches us about mob fighting. Alright, that's a good thing to know. L1 to deflect attacks. Now this is important. It's a very big part of the game. Well, one thing you want to note is that if they come from behind you, you can't really dodge their attacks. So try to always keep them on one side of you. This guy dropped some coins, so... I want to grab those. Now, despite it's talking about defending, that's not what you actually need to do right here. You need to kill everything. Whoa! Also, dodging can also work. That was what we were after. 